Alright guys, so before we get into this vlog, I just want to give a huge shout out to Squarespace for sponsoring this video. Um, we'll talk about them a little bit later and how it ties into the vlog, but for now, let's get into it. What is up guys? So right now we are at our Nike clearance store. So we took a little, uh, you know, morning road trip. Let's go check it out. A lot of you guys out there don't know that Nike actually owns Hurley. Mmm, so, and uh, Converse. Sherman. This is, I won't be surprised, this is $10. It's authentic too. Chelsea Football Club fans out there. Pretty cool little jersey. Ooh. Retail's $475, 350 with 30% off. So uh, Johnny's looking at this sweatshirt right now. How much is retail? $250. 250 Down to $125 with an additional wow. 30% off. This reminds me of that uh, backpack sweater that you were wearing, or jacket. No, it was a vest. A lot of people thought it was is a backpack. Is that a reverse yeah. backpack? Yo, Yo what did you just find? You know, I thought this was going to be a gem <laughs> back in the day. It's a $500 jacket, but I found one that might be in your size. Hey, hey, hey. It actually looks dope. I'm not like hyping you up, but it actually fits. You're not gassing me? Nah, it looks good. You should consider it. Damn, I didn't even know they made these anymore. No, nah, that's that, that Nike Lab too. $500 jacket. Wow. Right now is the moment of truth. We're seeing the price on the Nike Lab jacket that Tan found. $249 with 30% off. Not bad. <laughs> Nike Lab on the sleeve right here. One of my favorite Nike items to wear. These are kind of clean. Some more Nike Lab. Yo, Tan, what do you think about these, man? Are they too crazy? Not uh, crazy, but same time, they're kind of dope. <laughs> Subtle Nike swoosh. Yeah, that and then you got the zippered pockets. Yo, this is kind of hot. Retail is 70 bucks, but over here is 35. 20 bucks for the Nike Lab shorts. You guys let me know, was this a copper drop? We're gonna drop them, though. So I just found these LeBron James, John Elliott socks right here. It's pretty good find, $9.99. Got some Kobe 80s. Some Jordan 9 cleats right here. These are kind of crazy. All right, Johnny, what'd you find, man? Got a nice little Nike Lab uh, pullover for my little brother. I got myself a uh, Nike Lab hoodie. Woo! I've already got the gray, so I was happy I found the olives. Nice little season. Mm -hmm. Got their tones down. Yo, this is kind of fire right here. 250, 125 with 30% off. Kind of like a uh, knitted Nike Lab sweatshirt. But so we just left the Nike clearance store. Super successful. Shout out to Tan for finding this jacket right here. Just some damage out here. Yo, nice jacket, man. Hey, <laughs> got a lot of uh, Nike Lab stuff. Like we said, Nike clearance store. I was good. All right, guys. So earlier I mentioned that Squarespace.com is sponsoring this video. Right now I'm actually working on RichieLee.com. I'm just updating the website with our upcoming winter collection that we will be dropping. I'll talk about that in a second. But Squarespace.com, all right? A lot of people always ask me, what is like one thing that I recommend for marketing themselves and everything? And I got to say, a a website goes a long way if you could give someone your website after meeting them basically explaining them what it is that you do uh, maybe showcasing some of your artwork or maybe your videos or even maybe your photos I right? no longer do I even hand out like business cards if I meet someone and I'm trying to you know maybe work with them in the future I just give them richielee.com richielee.com was actually built on Squarespace so when they asked me to partner up with them I was all for it they have an online store marketing platform there's marketing tools there's a ton of things that you can build on Squarespace and uh, it's something Something that I personally use so I wanted to tell you guys about it and also we are gonna be uh, partnering together and running a special you guys right now can get a free website what? if you guys go to squarespace.com and when you guys are ready to launch you get 10% off with the link in the description box below so if you guys are ready to launch a website and you guys are you know you guys are wanting to build something hit that link in the description box below get 10% off and that's pretty much it man and uh, richielee.com like I said I'm updating the website right now these are the trekker pants that we will be dropping for the winter collection really cool details kind of got these like I don't know how to describe these kind of like trail looking uh, drawstrings you've got the metal tips and right here you kind of have like an adjustable cuff if you want a straight leg or a little bit more skinny you could have them zipped up but pretty much these trekkers will be dropping for the winter collection which we will be rolling out really soon there will be an official video for that but squarespace.com thank you for sponsoring this video that's pretty much it let's get back into the vlog Let's do it. What's going on, y'all? Big boy Johnny checking in. I am actually on my way to purchase a pair of Wave Runner 700s. I have to admit, I do not like Yeezys. You guys know that. But this is probably the first shoe that I have been flip-flopping over for quite some time now. I actually found a pretty good deal on OfferUp. And it's almost too good to be true. So I do have Richie's pair that I brought with me to compare. Here we go. 
All right, y'all, I just got here. I am not gonna lie, I am a little bit excited and nervous at the same time because I hope that these are real. Don't know what to expect, but we shall find out very soon. A few moments later. Damn, guys, so I just got done meeting up with the shoes. Almost fell for the story. It is so unfortunate. The shoes are actually fake. You know what they say, man? If it's too good to be true, it usually is. Uh, did a comparison with Richie's shoe. The leather was the only thing. That was the only thing that caught my attention. Watch out for these Fugazis out here and make sure you guys are double checking and legit checking your shoes. Again, if it's too good to be true, it probably is. All right, guys, so right now, I just want to take the time out to show you guys a couple of items that I'm currently wearing that I've got a few messages about. The first item are these Nike Tech Pack pants. They're kind of like Nike's new sportswear pants that they've been promoting a lot lately. I really like them because they're not your typical tech fleece that, you know, you see a lot of people wear. I've even had, like, I don't know how many pairs of tech fleece pants I've had in the past, but I thought, you know, these were a nice switch up. They kind of have the same silhouettes. They have this nice cuffing here on the ankle area. I mean, this material, at first when I saw it in the photos I was like that's you know kind of different kind of looks like I don't know some like futuristic foam it's actually like a woven material pretty comfortable I would say these are a nice alternative if you are getting a little bit tired of the Nike tech fleece pants you know I usually post on my Instagram stories you know my kicks of the day and people are asking what pants these are so they are the Nike tech pack pants and if you guys are wondering I wear a small in these all right so the next item I want to show you guys I rock these when I'm going to a little bit more of like a formal event um, these a lot of people were asking me what I'm wearing in the vlog where I spoke at Starbucks headquarters and I was rocking these long sleeves. These are actually $9.90 and $14.90 from Uniqlo and I gotta show you guys the difference. The $9.90 ones aren't as soft. Like if you look at the $14.90 ones, you can't really feel it, but it does kind of have like this fuzziness. It's very thick and it's just a little bit more premium than your regular long sleeve t-shirts. You got the $9.90 version, a little bit thinner, still gets the job done, but what really kind of gives it more of a formal vibe, the sleeves right here aren't like your typical long sleeves like you would see in streetwear, you know, where you have the cuff. This one you could actually uh, hike up, I would say, on your arms and it's gonna look pretty nice. So right here, it gives it a little bit more of a formal vibe. $14.90 and $9.90. If I had to choose, I would prefer the $14.91. It's just a lot thicker and softer. All right, so the last item I want to show you guys that I've been rocking a lot lately. You guys have been messaging me on Instagram about them or these shorts right here and these are actually from the Richie Lee collection dropping this winter these are samples but this exact color will be dropping I just wanted to show you guys every time someone asks me on Instagram you know I never answer the question just because I'm you know trying to keep it under wraps but you know this is the official announcement that these will be dropping the quality is oh my god the quality is crazy you got the cream drawstrings right here we made the drawstrings a little bit less thick than the last one so they're a little bit more comfortable you got this nice double mesh you got pockets Pockets, you know not doing too much. I hate when shorts like this and I absolutely hate this have zippers in the pockets It's like the number one thing that I hate when it comes to these basketball s shorts So we kept it pretty minimal, but these will be coming out in our winter fall line Which we will be announcing very soon. So just stay tuned That's pretty much it for some items that I'm rocking right now that you guys have asked me about Let's get back into the vlog. Hey, what up guys? So we just got to the airport. We are headed to LA right now. So we just ran into uh, Elzer, AKA Cap's new starting point guard. <laughs> we got a uh, pretty Rico lookalike over here. That's what everybody, everybody's like, who's the buffer on uh, tan over there playing basketball? That's his brother right there. Say what's up to the vlog. Hey, Yo, uh, so you, what, what, what got stuck in there? Oh, the piece of the charger got <laughs> So Tan's brother used the charger earlier at the airport and the piece of the charger got stuck in the phone. Stuck, bro. So you only got like five more hours left with your phone. Maybe less than that. <laughs> wah, wah, wah. Hold on. Is that the fake rolly? Is that, hey, Tan, is that the fake rolly? Julian got the fake rolly. Dude, show the ice, show the ice. Look at the touch. Yo, so here's the rolly that we're just talking about. It feel real, it look real. Hey, David and Andrews came through. Let me know, what up, man? Man, I'm not gonna lie, the rolly looks pretty nice. You know, for uh, 99 bucks from Vietnam, I'll take this rolly, man. 99 bucks. It's, it, it feels bad. Let's see, let's see where they at. That's Lonzo right here. Uh, okay, LeBron right here. 
got some pizza right now. Shout out to Tan for getting. What are you eating? Yo, uh, we, we eating Blaze Pizza, which is actually owned by LeBron. LeBron. It's owned LeBron. by LeBron. Yeah. So number he, he did the undercover. Uh, First day on the job. Yeah, I'm learning. Hey, oh, that's Ron and Ron. Ron. Got a Ron. How you doing, Ron? I'm Ron. So uh, that's the LeBron right there. Okay, this is called the LeBron. It's spicy chicken, mushrooms, and peppers. Give me the classic uh, pepperoni right here. guys that pretty much wraps it up for our la weekend trip we'll catch you guys later we're gonna grab a bite to eat oh, peace all right so that was the worst way you could have engineered no, the luggage no, you, don't, you don't even think about others when you want to like he just made a huge gap in the middle come on man look at this oh, I, didn't that. I didn't do that that was alvin i thought it was, it was already in there and he yeah, jumped there you go look at that boy look at that use of space right there All right, guys, so we just got back from LA, man. What a crazy trip. But uh, while I was in LA, all right, normally I do not go for releases for retail. For myself, I rather not like, you know, put myself in that position and get my hopes up. So when it comes to like Supreme drops, Nike drops, I usually just pay resale price. But I was on a uh, vacation and I remember I was uh, sleeping and my homie walked in the room and he was like, yo Rich, uh, the off-white 97s are about to drop on sneakers. So I was like, yo man, I was sleeping. I was like, man, trust me, I never get them. He's like, just try it right now, just try it. And then uh, crazy, shout out to uh, Nick, I ended up getting them. So got the off-white 97s. Let me unbox them right now. These are actually, it's kind of crazy because I got a shoe that I uh, ended up dropping on Hype Talk, but you know, let me see if they're worth keeping. Let me see if they're worth keeping. Yeah. A Nike receipt. Bam! Shout out to, uh, sometimes people in the comments are like, yo, I like when he says, bam, bam! I said in a Hype Talk, these are drop. I'm not gonna lie, so you know, I'll try to keep the same opinion. Just cause I own them now, doesn't mean. All right, let me do the investigation. It looks like a referee sneaker. These almost look like an ID team colorway. Okay, okay. Came with some uh, extra white laces. They don't look that dope in my opinion. Like I was saying, if the bottom was more of like a Vapor Max, like completely clear and translucent, that would have been cool. But these, yeah, I'm gonna have to go and say, I, I, I'm gonna keep the same opinion. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of the all black sneakers. And uh, I like, you know, maybe like a white midsole or something. So I'm gonna have to uh, sell these. If you guys are interested, hit me up. I'm not gonna ask any crazy price or anything. I got them for retail at the end of the day. But uh, you know, pretty cool getting a pair of off-white sneakers for retail, I'm not gonna lie. I thought that would never happen, so shout out to Nick for waking me up in LA. So this right here, this is actually a grail of mine. Uh, a few years ago, I wasn't able to afford these, but I sold them for the decent price online. So I decided to, you know, offer, offer the uh, seller, you know, a reasonable offer. He accepted. They are a pair of shorts collaboration. All right, you guys know what that is. Bam! All right, so I got the Nike Supreme shorts. I'm not gonna lie, this is the first time I've ever seen them in person, and the gold is like popping, like it's popping, it's like Laker gold. Yo, this has gotta be one of my, and you got a zipper back pocket. This has gotta be one of my favorite pickups recently, I'm not gonna lie, got some clean drawstrings. Super happy with the uh, purchase. You're kind of a collector's item, these dropped more than like, what, five years ago with the phone pauses. There we have it, we got the Air Max 97s and the Supreme Nike shorts. Thank you guys for checking out that vlog, man. Shout out to everybody we went to LA with. Had a super good time. And uh, that's pretty much it. Let us know down in the comments below if you guys want more vlogs like this. We'll definitely deliver. Thank you guys for all the support lately. Make sure you guys subscribe. Follow me on my social media accounts. And until next time, I'm out. Peace. All right, guys, thank you for checking out that video. And the shirt that I am rocking right now is the new Hype Talk merchandise. Make sure you guys hit up hypetalk.shop. I think there might be a few sizes left. There's a couple of the colors as well, super limited. These are the NASCAR t-shirts. Kind of got like that vintage vibe. And uh, that's pretty much it. I know a lot of people have been asking about it lately. So yeah, that's pretty much, I won't say that's pretty much it. Because that's it. Peace.